We're dealing with another day of heat and humidity. The area is staying dry, but there is a line of showers and thunderstorms well off to the northwest, and that will eventually filter into the area as a cold front approaches within the next or within the overnight period tonight and even into tomorrow. But for today, we're going to stay hot and humid. And when the cold front arrives, we're finally going to have some relief in temperatures in the forecast and also a chance for showers and thunderstorms this evening. Still staying dry here in downtown Lafayette. Clear skies. It's a beautiful morning. 74 degrees. Winds are also staying calm, but it's already humid and it's only going to continue throughout the day. We do have our heat advisory still in effect for the northern counties, and this will continue until 8 p.m. this evening which is finally some good news because we're finally going to get a break from that heat after we get through the day today. 76 degrees at 8 in the morning with mostly sunny skies climbing up to 89 degrees with mostly sunny skies as well through noon. And I'm even going to say we're going to stay mostly dry till 5, but there is still a slight chance for a pop-up shower or thunderstorm after 5 p.m. with a temperature of 95 degrees. And just check out these highs for today. Climbing up into the mid-90s, 94 from Monticello and Winnemac, 94 also down in Crawford. 95 degrees in Attica and here once again a high of 95 degrees. Tonight we're going to fall into the lower 70s, 70 for Remington, 71 for Fowler and 71 degrees here in Lafayette. Future cash shows we're going to have a dry start Friday morning. The show's 7 in the morning. We're going to stay dry even through lunch just seeing some clouds starting to filter in from the south and then we'll start, start to see the rain move in. This shows Friday at 7. There's that line of showers and thunderstorms. This will filter in as we head off throughout the evening and this shows Saturday at midnight so that line is going to move through I would say between 8 p.m. and 11 p.m. tonight and then we start to see those lingering showers around midnight and then we're going to see on and off showers throughout the entire day tomorrow. Actually, I would say until the evening hours, just so Sunday at lunch hour, and then we'll start to dry out a little bit once we get into the evening. But there is a chance for a slight, there's a slight risk for, or a slight chance for severe weather, especially for the northern counties. And this is a chance um, for gusty winds mostly for our area. And even a high of 85 degrees for Saturday, still seeing that chance for showers and thunderstorms. And taking a look at our week ahead, after that cold front moves through, we finally get some relief. A high of 85 degrees, which is our average high on Saturday, dropping to 83 by Sunday, mostly sunny skies. Sunday's looking pretty nice, and even Monday with partly cloudy skies and a high of 85, and then we'll stay in the mid-80s for the rest of the week with thunderstorm chances returning by Tuesday. Well, it's nice.